Senko AP Physics Experiment Number 17, Electrical Resistance. Students will investigate the factors that affect electrical current through a conductor and use Ohm's Law to calculate the electrical resistance of a resistor. They will explore the factors that contribute to the electrical resistance of a material. They will identify the resistance value of a resistor by using the color codes on the resistor. They will interpret simple circuit diagrams and use them to construct circuits using resistors and batteries. They will use a digital multimeter to measure the voltage and current through a resistor and differentiate between the effect of connecting resistors in series versus connecting them in parallel. They will relate the brightness of a light bulb to its electrical resistance. The kit includes two uniquely designed circuit boards, three bulb socket holders, three battery pack holders, wires, and a multimeter. The first few experiments the students can do with this lab activity is to investigate simple circuits, Ohm's Law, and series and parallel circuits. The included circuit boards make it very easy to pass these out into a group and all the resistors that you needed are included with very easy to connect bolt connectors. Uh, the first activity the students simply use one resistor, measure the voltage, measure the current, and determines Ohm's law, then use a different resistor or change the voltage across the resistor to see how that affects Ohm's law. The two boards have two distinct setups. The first board has three resistors that are the same, so you can connect these in series or in parallel. The second one has individually different resistors and then two unknowns. The color coding on them have been covered up so the students can't use the coding system to determine what the resistance is. They're going to have to use Ohm's Law. The last activity that students can investigate is how light bulbs are affected in a series or parallel circuit. With the circuit board, it's very easy to set up a series circuit for the students to investigate or to set up a parallel circuit so they're not wasting a lot of time switching components around.